recording. <laughs> What's up, everybody? Air check. Avoid the noise. Bling. Whatever. Got that the devil's chaos. chaos here. I'm not drunk enough yet. Bear with me. Mm -hmm. I'm already <laughs> well into the alcohol at this point. Try anyway. something new doing video. T video. Doing a vlog thing. Yeah, one of them. Video log. What hell of a word. Whatever. Anyway, just doing a random. <laughs> I'm not oh. putting my drink down. <laughs> oh, hell, you're not gonna put your drink down. I'm not gonna put my drink down. Only for 21. Anyway. And don't drink and drive. Random, just. Just stupid, random shit tonight. Nothing about the gameplay. Don't give a shit about the gameplay. This it is, was fun. This is about all the gameplay commentary you're going to get. Okay, it was Horde Mode with Double O Zombie, Swiss Cheese, and... You. Me, myself, yeah. AirTech, no, wait, Xbox, Avoid the Noise 62, and... Somebody Headshot. Else. I wasn't there. Yep. Chaos wasn't here. She's just here for the commentary for because I wanted her here. Anyway. Yeah. <laughs> commentary over the video. Video we actually started. We were playing horde mode, Gears 3. Um I think Well actually yeah, we started at round one and just started going and it just literally kept going and going and going. I'm gonna be the asshole ever. and I'm gonna say I didn't think you guys were gonna make it though. No, I <laughs> totally say I did not think we were going to last this long. So I recorded it. I was like, she, well, shit, Hop Hog's hooked up, so I might as well hit record. <laughs> yeah, she hit record button at round 26, 27-ish, whatever the hell round this starts out. I think it's round 27. But, um, uh, yeah, we were just playing. Never even thought we were going to get this far. Uh, I've already posted one quick clip of Double O Zombie on here and he totally freaking pulled one out of his butt. Um, He's one of those people we can learn a lot of skills good from. Good lord, man. The, the dude is just a straight up beast, apparently. Um, we like can I, learn a lot from him. Like I said on the, the other commentary for that one, I met him on one of the uh, zom Call of Duty zombie forums. Uh, but yeah, he is just a killer player. Just straight up. There's no other way to describe it. But uh, this is segment one. This video ended up being probably 70 minutes total. Uh, from round 27, I think, around 46 before we actually Which took gave an up. absolute eternity to load onto oh, the map. Five hours of mm -hmm. yeah. All day. Whole another story in itself. We <laughs> definitely need to upgrade to another program. We're trying to change our setups around, but well, it's not even the setup. We don't have the proper program for the Mac to convert the files from the hop off. We need to get out to get Yeah. Fundage is a little tight at the moment. Um, I'm no longer working. I'm trying to find employment. The camera's up there. Oh, I know, but I don't <laughs> want to look at. It. I don't want to see it. And you totally touched my boot. <laughs> anyway. But, uh, no, I'm trying to find employment, but, um, it makes it hard to have Lyme disease and work a full-time job and have two kids. And that, it's not possible. It's, Flat out. It's not possible. I can't do full-time. There's absolutely zero possibility of a full-time job going into effect anytime soon. Uh, so basically, yeah. I'm the breadwinner. Part-time, yes, but... It's really hard when you have the, like the Lyme because oh you Even, end up with so many different co-infections. Because of all the antibiotics I was on, now I have other problems and other infections because of the medication stripping my immune system down to nothing. Yeah, and so, it, it, I could sneeze on her and she'll be sick for a month. But. Yeah. Either way, that's neither here nor there. The basic premise of this particular <laughs> vlog. I'm going to drink your drink. 
<laughs> what the hell? Mine's empty, and I don't want to get up to get soda. I'm gonna cry. Oh wait. Hold on. Let me block the label because I don't want to get copyright infringement. <laughs> oh god. Anyway. Yeah. Going anyway. on. Um. Okay. I had a couple of ideas for this one. Just random stupidness. The biggest one of those. Traffic. Oh my god. If anybody doesn't get it, we live near Charlotte, and right now Charlotte is hosting the NASCAR race. And. Race City, USA. If Mooresville, North Carolina. If you're not a redneck, you shouldn't live here. I no, am. period. <laughs> Enough said. <laughs> if you're, and it's got, don't even, don't even think for one second. I see somebody already commenting. Hey, what's wrong with redneck? We rednecks. I am a redneck. Totally will fucking own it. I own it like a freaking badge, like these damn Gears of War, Call of Duty, freaking dog tags. I don't even care. I am a redneck, period. But if you're not a NASCAR fan, do not move anywhere near any city that has a track. Charlotte, 25 minutes away from here. I can just imagine what Indy has to go through. Or Daytona. Oh god, I can't even imagine. Because, okay. Daytona's probably hell year round. Yeah, Daytona fucking sucks all the time. So, <laughs> Charlotte, North Carolina, Mooresville, North Carolina. Mooresville, there is. I don't even know how many different race companies, race yeah. teams. And in they've this all area. changed hands now, and it's. It's hell. But we live like a mile away from like five of them. No, oh, shit. Five? <laughs> At least. Shit. Try about 25. Oh, I know Junior Nation's not far away. JR Motorsports, um, Petty. Ganassi, Petty. DI. It goes on. They're all in that on. same little area. Regardless, do not live anywhere near a major racing track if you do not like racing in general. And here's why. Okay. Charlotte, great, great area most of the time. Beautiful city. Yeah. yeah, there's plenty to see, plenty to do. But my God, there's three weeks out of the year that you cannot get around without running on the track. Just period, point blank. And that's not even counting the normal everyday traffic. Yeah, because normal summer everyday traffic, you're going down the interstate and there's this one window of lake. And every boat <laughs> has to be there oh, my God. with like just bikini chicks. And half of them aren't even attractive. They kind of, they look worse than me, which is pretty bad because I'm in my PJs. I haven't brushed my hair all day. <laughs> so, and traffic slopes. It's, it's like nobody's ever seen water. I, I don't get it. Again. And it's not even good water. Not it's even. It's like brown and sewagey. <laughs> Lake Norman largest man-made lake in this entire state of North Carolina. Whatever. Who cares? It's fucking water. And it's a lake. Yeah. There's no big deal. But every freaking jackass in the, in the damn lake thinks they have to park right beside the fucking interstate just because they can and because they can slow down traffic. Okay, fine. Whatever. That's normal summertime, springtime traffic. But race week. Oh my god, you talk about the fucking annoying. I live in Mooresville, North Carolina. There is the Charlotte Motor Speedway, which is literally about 30 minutes away. Okay, two races, three races, I'm sorry, three races every year. You got the Coke 600, you got the All Star, All -Star Nextel, whatever the hell you want to call it. And then you got the, the, the 
Race okay. for the chase, yeah. whatever this one that is in, in coming right now. You got those three races. Okay. Here's the biggest problem. Every racing fan in the freaking country has to come to this area. That's fine. Canadians. Come on! <laughs> oh my god. We get bombarded wait, wait. with Canadians. Wait. <laughs> There's the NASCAR Hall of Fame in downtown Charlotte. There's the... What's the... There's, the the, there's some type of museum in here in Mooresville. There is God knows how many there's total restaurant freaking restaurants. With a car, or like with a row of NASCARs. Oh, no, no, no. That's Lancaster's. That's... No, that's Big Daddy. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. You're talking about the one on the top. Yeah? On the outside. Yeah, Big Daddy's... Four or five cars on the There's top of the building. On the sides Lancasters. of the road selling cars. Lancaster's parts. place up here. They've got. I mean, the entire inside is just freaking decked out. There's. I don't know how many freaking racing shops in general in this area. There's. God knows how much racing shit in Harrisburg, Concord, whatever you want to call it, Charlotte, where the track is. The majority of this is home field for 99% of NASCAR. These guys live for these few weeks in this town. When the races come, there's more traffic in this town than, I don't even know where the fuck they come from. I, I can tell you, we've been to the mall in Concord, Concord Mills. We've seen like, Alaska plates. Seriously, <laughs> fucking Alaska, Canadian plates. Um, Anywhere in the country, you can name it, we've seen it. Yeah. You go to Gander Mountain or Bass Pro Shops, oh my God. Bass Pro Shops, race week, seriously, that is like the fucking redneck convention from hell. They park their RVs out in Walmart. You cannot find a parking spot at Bass Pro Shop. Right now, I fucking promise you, there is not an empty parking spot at Bass Pro. It's 9 o'clock at night. That fucking place is packed, I promise you. Like I said, we've been to Bass Pro when race week went on. There was Alaska plates, Kentucky plates, Canadian plates. Just fucking... Anybody that says the rednecks are only in the fucking south, you're full of shit. There's rednecks all over the fucking globe. Gander Mountain, Bass Pro, race week, I promise you. You will fucking see a redneck from every state. That's all that, I want to say about it. That is the week where people of Walmart need to come here. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> because, I mean, I look amazing right now in my PJs and my bad hair and my bad teeth. But, oh my goodness, there are some amazing looking people at Walmart during oh. race week. <laughs> yeah, could you go in the parking lot at our local Walmart Supercenter. Which not only has a car place, but you can buy food in it. You got the auto, auto side <laughs> on one side. You got the fucking garden center, the outdoor stuff, all that plants and whatever. And then you got Walmart. Then you got the Walmart grocery section. Which Holy shit. Is it the meats oh, I will buy, but like, you know, there's other things in there that well, I will buy. Either way. So, yeah, traffic recently has sucked balls. That's all I'm going to say about that. Um, we went on a 15-minute rampage. Hell yeah, traffic. we did. <laughs> traffic. You want to talk? Time to I do heating and air for a living. I go out. I drive around all fucking day long. My last call was in Harrisburg. Harrisburg, North Carolina. Where the speedway is. At 6 o'clock. The race is at 7.30. Traffic on a Friday already bad enough. You throw a race traffic on that, I swear to God, it took me an hour and a half to get home. Normally, that's a 30 minute drive. Yeah, I know. All you California people are bitching. Oh, that's nothing. You should drive to Nelton. Fuck you. I don't care. It's not my problem <laughs> that y'all live in a state with like a million fucking people in one little city. Sorry. Because there's not that many residents. Holy shit. <laughs> it's unfucking real. 
and then there's wrecks every, everywhere on this fucking day. I don't know what the hell happened, but these people have lost their goddamn minds today. So, anyway, 15 minutes worth of rant over traffic. Imagine that. Mm. Anything else? I need more Jack. Or I should just say whiskey. Yeah. I'm sorry. Copyright! I need, I need more Copyright. whiskey. Copyright! No, they're gonna get us in trouble for being really bad. See that? That's a vape. That's not a real cigarette. That's it. King Vapes. Vapes. King Who's next?